Hey entrepreneurs, it's Sam Day here from Day Tips and in this video, I'm speaking about how you can create an e-commerce website, wait for it, for free using a platform called Square. Now I'm going to be leaving all of the links to where you can access Square in the description down below. So if you are on a shoestring budget, but you want to start an e-commerce website and you don't have the funds or the means at the moment to create a website that is premium, but you want a good, attractive looking website to start selling your products without having to spend upfront money, this might be a great solution to you. This video is kindly sponsored by Square, so a huge shout out to them for giving me access to their platform so that I can showcase it to you guys in this video. So as you can see, I'm actually on Square at the moment, and this is what their homepage looks like. You want to kind of log in and create yourself an account, and once you do, your dashboard should look something like this. Now, I know it looks a little bit complicated to start off but you will get used to it and you basically want to come down here to where it says online and then it will take you basically to where you can start developing your website so um, as you can see it says website here um, and there's different elements that you can actually edit so you can edit the site itself some of the seo functionalities uh, some form submissions and site visibility you can also ed edit the items so site items site categories coupons gift cards, customer reviews, and so on and so forth. Um, and you can also edit your orders, your fulfillment, uh, your reports, marketing, sales channels, so on and so forth. So um, as you can see, it kind of prompts you to design your website. So when you click on that, it takes you in here where you can actually start the, the design of your site. So um, as you can see, this, when you, when you, when you hover over the dis different sections here, the site on the website actually starts to move accordingly. So you can edit your header literally by clicking on your header and different options start to appear. So you can start to edit the content here. If you wanted to change this from my business, let's say I wanted this to say uh, day tips by literally typing in day tips. And this is similar to editing of any other aspect of the site. You can hover over the the, the aspects that you want to change, you can click on them and you can um, start editing them. So for example, this button, um, I can edit uh, the, the links, what page I want it to link to. I can have it link to an external link as well if I wanted to and paste the link in there. I can have it open in a new tab or not if I didn't want to. Um, you can play about with how big you want the, the button to be and the color and so on and so forth. So you can literally just click on any, any element and you can start to change it. Um, now, if you don't want an element, then you literally scroll over the element that you do not want. Let's say I don't want this locations here, then I can literally just click on the bin button and that element will be deleted from the website. I can also add sections as well by clicking on add section and I can add featured items, featured categories, donations, memberships, all of these different things to my site, including embed code as well. If I wanted to um, add some snippet of code to this page as well, I can add text, text and image, um, all of these different things and you know forms and so on and so forth I can add. So let's say for example, I wanted to add an email subscription form and um, then I can add that in there and when I click on the form itself, uh, it gives me customization uh, options. So I can customize the layout and how it looks, um, so on and so forth. And I can actually customize the title, um, the size of the font, the description I can customize, and I can add a little image in there. Let's say I wanted to add an image of myself. Um, I can add an image in there uh, and save that and change this again, maybe to say something like day tips. I can save it to the site and it will look like that. So you you know, you can kind of like quickly and easily just make this, this page and this site your own. Um, obviously I've kind of gone through it really quickly here, but hopefully you get the, the, the gist of how quick it is to just make simple edits to your website. And you can also preview your site at any point as well to see how it looks 
both on a desktop and on a mobile phone device as well so you can see how it operates. Um, now I recommend kind of keeping your site as simple as possible so people can quickly access the products that they want to purchase um, and that will kind of help you to improve your conversion rates. So you can also navigate through the different pages that are currently on your site. As you can see, I've got home, um, I've got shop all, um, and there's the story pages and, and item pages which haven't been set up yet, but I can click add item if I wanted to. I can also click up here and add a page as well. Um, this also add, allows me to add a section to the current page that I'm editing. So if I click add section, you will see it add a section to the bottom here. And with these sections, you can also move them up and down as well. So if you wanted one section to be higher, um, then you can simply just move it higher or move it lower according to where you want it. So it's fairly easy to kind of like navigate and um, make changes to the site. You can also add um, an item as well. So you can add a new product if you wanted to um, put all of the product details in here and that will add the product to your website. Um, and you can add a category as well. This is great for SEO. Um, you add your category title, you can add what items or what products are in this category and you can actually create a, a category image and there's also all sorts of SEO benefits as well to add in categories. You can have a permalink to this category, um, which you can actually, you know, make SEO friendly. So include your keywords in here. You can have an SEO title and an SEO description, which I highly recommend um, that you do as well. If you come up here to where it says homepage or whatever page it is that you are editing at the moment, you can actually also edit your navigation menu. So when you click on that, it will take you up here where you can add navigation link or all of the pages that you've currently set up. You can actually uh, play about with them and you know switch it around. You can add subfolders if you want to. And this kind of just allows you to play about with it so you can choose how you want your navigations to look. So once you've kind of finished with your website and it's, it's how you want it to look, um, you simply click the publish button and what will happen is you can find a custom domain so you can build your professional brand with a unique website um, like a .com or you can use a square domain if you wanted to keep it free I um, mean you can use a square domain um, and you can click change and your site will be published at the domain that it is here so you want to make sure um, that if you are using the free version that you keep note of what your domain is you can start promoting that link and then you have your website set up and it's as simple as that so it's a very simple and easy platform to use i'll leave all of the details in the description down below if you want to try it out yourself um, but one thing that you do have to know is although the website platform itself is free they do charge you a small percentage on the sales that you make from your products so that's something that you've got to keep in mind as well um, but yeah if you're looking for a free solution to set up an e-commerce website make sure you check out Square. I also have the free formula guys. This is the free guide to generating leads and sales online. So once you build your e-commerce website, if you then want to go on to start generating sales and revenue for your online store, then you need to know the strategies, how to perform SEO, things such as like uh, Google pay-per-click and Facebook marketing. If you wanna understand some of the fundamentals to those things, then make sure you download the formula. It's completely free. As you can see, there's a copy beside me. There's also a copy somewhere on this screen and in the description down below. So I really hope that this video helped you out. And if it did, then please click the like button down below and make sure you share this video with a friend. If you have any additional questions or comments, then leave them for me in the comment section. But until next time, watch some of my other great videos. Make sure you subscribe to this channel for more awesome business related content. Have a great day. Make sure you download the formula and I'll see you soon.